real experiments. Dan with Imagination Station, good morning. Good morning. Yes, so I've brought balloons. In, I've got lots of balloons. Okay. Looks like a party Let's over keep here. Some of them over um, here. All right. But to party with some different types of gases. Okay. So okay. we know that the balloons you can fill them up with all sorts of different gases. I have got some balloons with just regular air. I've got a, some balloons with helium, and I have a very special gas called sulfur hexafluoride, which we'll get. Okay. Sulfur, sulfur hexafluoride. Hexa right. And okay. We'll get to that in a second. Um, but you may have, you know, heard. People, they breathe in helium and it does something. It, it kind of high pitches your voice a little bit. It's yeah, a little changes, fun to do. Yeah, changes your voice. Yeah. Okay, um, now that's a little bit, we don't really want people to try that at home. We're going to try it on TV so you don't have to. Because when you breathe sure. in helium, these gases that I have here are like 99% pure and you're not breathing in oxygen. Oxygen. Which is what your body needs. So, right. So don't you, try this at home. Don't try it at home. And it's okay if we do it here in just a little spurt. You don't want to do it over and over again though. Right. Obviously. So I've got some helium here and we can okay. see its effects well, when I breathe in. So. So helium, when you breathe it in, okay, it's three times lighter or about five times lighter than regular air. And I can get some Even oxygen. Even as an adult, it's still just as Back amusing into my to lungs. listen to it. Okay, it's very, very light. You can see it's floating up. I've got these balloons here. It's much lighter than air. It's less dense. So that's how you make it stop being such a high-pitched voice when you breathe in the oxygen. When back you breathe it back in, okay. all right, the vibrations that from your voice are not traveling through helium. And air or sound actually travels about uh, three times faster through helium than it does just because it's that through much regular lighter. air because it's so much lighter okay. it travels faster Got that's it. what makes that your makes sense. voice sound high pitched right okay now uh, helium's okay so we'll get rid of that one but this gas that was the balloon is much different this is sulfur hexafluoride this is five times heavier than air feel this balloon so it's it's actually like weighed it down feels really heavy it kind of feels like there's almost this like is like a the weight inside. this is the exact opposite of that one because helium you think would rise helium this rises. one is kind of heavy this one is much more dense okay heavy. um so i've actually got some he sulfur hexafluoride gas inside this container so i'm going to take this carefully off here okay and uh go ahead and grab one of these balloons filled with air and just kind of put them inside and see what happens just drop it in there whoa it doesn't want to go in there. It's like it's almost like a magnet okay. repulsing each other. Okay. So I think that might be a little bit of static electricity, but that's okay. But you can see they're not sinking all the way to the bottom, right? right they're just kind of floating. They're kind of bobbing, magic. bobbing up or there, science. up and down, because it's actually floating on a little pool of sulfur hexafluoride gas. Right. Okay. So you, we can't so see it, but it's we there. can't see it, but it's there. It's so much heavier that you can't really see. So it's like a swimming pool, kind of, but a swimming pool of gases. Exactly. Exactly. So. I've got the sulfur hexafluoride in here, and Ryan, I'm going to have you breathe this in okay. for me. Okay. I have a feeling this okay. is going to do about the opposite. Let's so see. what I'm going to have you do okay. is kind of breathe out, and then breathe take out. a big breath in of our sulfur hexafluoride. Okay. Okay. And then say, say something. something. Say something. Ready? Big breath. Big breath. Perfect. All right. Go ahead and speak. E go ahead. Let's try it. Eeny, meeny, miny. Let's try some more. All right, well, oh, there it is. is. Okay, try one more time. Take a deep breath. Old McDonald Hall of Farm. E I E I O. <laughs> I kind of like this. I'm like the Jolly Green Giant. <laughs> okay, so, oh, oh. so go ahead and breathe in. Take it, breathe out and breathe in. One more time. We, one more time. Are we back to normal? A little, a little bit. bit. Okay. Uh -huh. So you want to get that oxygen back into your lungs. But the same thing's happening. This is so heavy <laughs> that when sound tries to travel through it, it's traveling three times slower than so it normally it, would. So it's more difficult. So it's like though. trudging through like the toxic sludge. Of... It's kind of like everything was put in slow motion with your voice. That's kind of how I just wanted to talk when I was doing that. So it's kind of fun. It's really cool. And there's.